Have you ever noticed when you look up into the trees that certain tree crowns have a gap between them? Like a wonderful mosaic pattern in the sky. Well, this is not by chance. It is actually a phenomenon that the trees consciously practice, kind of like social distancing of trees. Let's explore further. In the 1920s, a special phenomenon in trees called crown shyness was observed. What exactly is crown shyness? It is a naturally occurring phenomenon in certain species of trees like oak, pine, eucalyptus and some other species of tropical trees too, where the utmost branches do not touch each other, keeping a definite separation or no touch zone around each tree crown, almost like a jigsaw puzzle in the sky. Experts aren't exactly sure why this happens, but they've been studying it for decades and have quite a few theories, like probably optimized resource sharing in terms of exposure to sunlight. Trees need adequate light as they create their own food via photosynthesis, which is probably why they leave a gap between each other in order to non-competitively share the available sunlight in the best possible way, so that there is enough space for the sunlight to filter through. They can also probably sense that something is blocking the sunlight and avoid growing towards that area. Another theory is that trees sway in the wind and thrash into one another. Twigs and branches break and growth nodules are damaged, creating gaps around each crown. A related theory is that trees leave spaces between them in an attempt to prevent one another's branches from getting cracked and broken in the wind due to friction. Yet other researchers think it could be to inhibit the spread of leaf-eating insect larvae or harmful insects or even fungal or bacterial disease which may be something for us to definitely learn during these times of social distancing. So, the next time you are hiking through a forest or thickly wooded area, look up and see if you can spot any trees displaying this very interesting phenomenon of crown shyness.